Alright guys, we're back with another episode of You're Awful Crash. That's what I spend all day saying. Alright, but look, let me hang on, let me grab. Ah, crash! I think that's what I should do, though. I should just set up live cam. I could go inside and watch. That's what I should do. I guess I could get surveillance cameras. Anyway, I've got a few different things, and this is from... This is the thing that Angie Marie gave me, which is, you know, for their little charity thing. It says Hope For Us. I don't know what it is. I see it's a bullet. I see it's supposed to look kind of rustic. And I sort of kind of finally figured out, well, maybe is it a... But then I said to myself... Are we drinking that much beer that we've actually, oh, Carl just tipped you guys, that we actually have to have a device to open it? Is it that bad? <laughs> That's what I said. Um, and, oh, okay, so then I've got a pack of cards. This is all new stuff, too. And then this is, these are just all, they have these little goodie bags, so these are all, oh, these are all perfect. So this is just like a little... I don't know, something. And then this is a beer. Clearly a drinking crowd, but I don't know. Let me know. Is this? That's the only thing I could figure out. I said maybe it's a thing where you pop the top of the beer. But then I thought, we're drinking that damn much that we gotta have this thing. Now you're scaring me. All right, and then I've got the pink hat. I'm gonna put up here the phones, and I'm gonna set up my baskets. And I don't think she's gonna run away to the pond because it's so cold. It's bitter, bitter cold out today. All right, so I'm just gonna set up my coat. On there, but I don't think she's gonna run away because I'm trying to kind of use that too as a little bit of a. I think you would want to say, well, I want to cover as much area as possible. Oh, the other thing I had in here was this little tiny bracelet. I could put this, I could put the bracelet on here and this thing on here. Let me tell you what, it's cold out here. Anyway, I'm sorry, I was just ranting like a lunatic on my thing. But at least I got Rob to do the dating game. It's so fun. You set up the profile, but you pick the one for your friend. And it's fun because they don't like the ones you pick. <laughs> they like the, you know, the fakey, flashy ones. You have to steer them away from them. Oh, I don't even have the collar. I gotta get the collar on it. Oh, where's even your collar, Crash? Is the collar still in there? She might bring her own collar. Okay, so that's the little... <laughs> That's the little key thing. All right, so if she brings her own collar, I'll put it on. Oh, okay, I think the key thing was on top of the footstool. She missed the basket because it was in a different, it wasn't in the middle there. She's gonna find it though. Uh 
Oh, picking and choosing. You see that? I think she's going to get that little wood thing. I knew she was going to get that. I don't know why. I just, when I saw it, I said, oh, this will be perfect for Crash. But then I didn't know what it was. If she's picking out the new stuff, I think she is, Mike. I think she's picking out all the new stuff. Oh, there was a treat in there. OMG, if she just brings this whole basket, she's pretty much, oh, here's her own collar. Okay, good. Uh, she's pretty much just saying to hell with this. Fancy crash. That was always your favorite before crash. You see, she's got the same behavior. She goes and then she hooks around that one. So I think I could, I could even give her running around a cone. Oh, the phone. Oh, that little kit thing. All right, but there was my guarding behavior. And if you said she didn't know what that was, I totally think you should install that on all, especially, oh, you little monkey crash. <laughs> you little high stepper. Oh, crash, oh, oh, well, there you go, crash. That's what happens. That's what happens when you get the basket without the stuff. Now you're gonna have to get all the stuff, crash. Mm -hmm. Oh, you like that. I knew you shoot all of these things. I think anything like this that you can get, you know, it's just a random, I guess it, oh, it's a little first aid kit. How absolutely perfect. All right, that's a deck of cards. So that is a little heavier, but she doesn't really, uh, to me, she doesn't seem that deterred by weight just because she'll pick up really big things. All right, so she's got the keys and the collar. Oh, she's getting the hat. She's getting the hat. Watch out. Hang on. You little monkey crash. She's got a good return, too. I think if you remember, one time she did, and luckily I had the collar on her, but one time she did get it and take off. I don't know if you remember that, Mike. She got it and took off. Oh, okay, the bracelet's still over there. Oh, she's looking. Mm -hmm. Oh, you little monkey crush. She can't wait to get... You know, if you said one day she's going to find something that's lost and everything in her life was for that, the most important thing I said, I believe that. All right, so I got to try just looking right there, even though she's got to have some idea... If you said, why would she have some idea? Because she looked there before, and there's something with dogs called Hunt the Old Fall, and Mark will tell you about that. You know, if you found something one time before, if you found what you wanted at Target, oh, little monkey crash. Oh, she might be running off with this thing. She does like a little, like a little toss thing, and I'll tell you, that's my signal. Make a move, make a move. Because if you said, what's that a precursor for? Yeah, maybe this. You're just getting the same things, Crash. All right, I'm going to try looking at these keys and see if she'll... And I'm not exactly sure which way my wind is blowing, but I think it's going this way. All right, there's my guarding. You're awful. That's that's what she does, like with the, uh, uh, you know, the cord of the blow dryer saying, anything's, anything's, you know, anything's fair game, anything that can be picked up at all. She's going back over there to look. She just doesn't really, you know, and if you said, how would you fix the dog picking the basket up? Well, 
you'd have to get rid of the basket. <laughs> you know, you'd have to get rid of the basket. She's gonna find him though. Okay, she bumped her foot into that collar. That's how she found it. And it was just random because she didn't smell it at all. She didn't smell it at all. She was walking by and I could, I, cause I could see her. I could see her and she didn't smell it at all but she hit it with her foot. All right, so the only thing she has to find is those keys. I've got to somehow do the send away. It's so cold too, Crush. You need your clothes on. All right, she sent away, but she went to look for the hat. All right, be careful. Oh, Crush. Yeah, oh, Crush. <laughs> right, hang on, she's oh, right on top of it. She found him. Oh, you little monkey, Crush. If you said, why do you talk to the dog? I'm crazy. Anyway, again, another, uh, hi, John. I don't know if you've told my crash story, but she's blind and deaf and she's smarter than me. Anyway, does anybody know what this thing is? I just, I'm going to text Angie Marie, but I, if it is something to open a beer can, good God, we need a tool. All uh, right, watch. I'm going to run three things down here real quick. I got this. I got the keys. And the cards. Ah! And if you said she's following your trail, I'd say, she does. Oh, she, she loves those keys. You know, and if you said, what do they represent? Nothing. I've never locked the doors to this house I, in the 10 years I've lived here. So there's no keys that, you know, have any association. All right, she's going to get that one. Oh. Little monkey crash. You know, I think it would be, I'm going to order a couple more of those footstools because I think it would be, I know this sounds crazy, but I think you could get, if you put them in the same place, you could do a little pattern uh, send away. If she knew to go right there and look, she's going to look and she's, She's learned now, I think, maybe to look on the top of them. Oh, she smelled them now. She smelled them now. Look at Molly sitting in the sun. I don't know if you're there, Sophia. Oh, she's, I'll tell you, she said, why is Molly hanging so close? Because I got chicken. Uh-oh, God, no, she's running away and I don't have the collar on. Oh, she's coming back, thank God. All right, I got to send her for the cards. because it's so windy, I'd say, well, that might have something to do with it. All right, so my job is now to send her with psychic. I put the one video on YouTube is telepathy training. What are these people going to say? If they said it's not telepathy training, I was going to say, then what's your explanation? Oh, boy, she's running away. All right, hang on. Let me see if I, I, see if I can do my recall. If, if the wind is blowing the way I think it is. Oh God, oh God, here we go. All right, psychic recall, psychic recall. Ah! All right, hang on, psychic recall. because I'll tell you what's kind of getting her. I, I can already see what it is. It's the wind. She's trying to follow the wind. And I. this is something I did notice about her. And maybe it is because of the blind deaf thing. But like the first time when she was in the rain, she was like having, but if you said that wasn't a recall, it just seemed like it was coming to me. I was thinking of picking up that footstool. I don't understand why you're not finding those things, Crash. Hang on. Let me give you a little psychic test. You know, but I think. 
think if I set up, I think if I set up a specific pattern instead of just doing it too random, I'd have to find a place to do it though. I'll, get this. Well, I'll tell you what happened. If you said what just happened, she got a whiff of those cards. That's why she abandoned that thing real quick. She's just not that good at finding them. She's gonna find them now though. Hang on. I mean, she just hasn't even looked there. So my find a key business isn't getting off the ground. She's looking for I'm just going to tell you right now, she's looking for it. And she's going to really be happy when she finds it. Maybe I should make it easier. I don't want her to not be successful. Put it in a little convoluted area. But I am going to get more of those things because I do... I do see where it's a cone. And I can't really have cones because mine pick them up. Alright, Crush, you've got one more thing to find. You can do it. Alright, so I'm going to try to do the hand send away. You see, she's really proud of herself. She's really proud of herself. She'll kind of do a little launcher. She's proud of herself. Oh, my little hero, Crush. And, you know, maybe if you said it was... I don't know, you know, I don't think, uh, to me, if you said what would the hardest thing in there to find be, to me, it would be these. And if you said why, because that's what they make police dogs find and stuff, and they make it hard. It's just, you know, the part where it seems like you can kind of send her away, either that or it's just completely random. All right, let me see if I can send her over there. Loves those little keys. I don't know, Mike. I don't know if you're watching, but it did kind of seem like she was like Helen Keller in my hands right there, didn't it? Like she kind of knew they were pointed. Anyway, I may be losing it. I see I'm losing it. We'll do that with bag and see. She's literally losing it. So, yeah, I don't know. You know, to me, if you said of all of these things, what would be the hardest thing to find? I mean, if you said, well, pick something, I'll have the dog find it. I, and I wanted to pick the hardest thing. I mean, I think I would pick this. But that she seems to be very interested in finding it. And it was just random because I really don't have any keys. All right, guys, I'm going to be right back with that uh, deaf bulldog. She's still looking.